It's being called the Trump bump. Despite an initial plummet on election night, the Dow soared after President-elect Donald Trump's upset victory with finance and energy stocks leading the way. All right, um, on the markets in general, are you worried after a pretty quiet August, you're a pretty good investor, that we're in for a rocky fall? Everyone worries about that as we get to the fall. Are you? Yes, absolutely, because we don't know what we don't know. Um, I think there are so many external global influences on our market. You know, what money comes here when there's uncertainty overseas? What money goes into treasuries? And where does it go if, you know, rates go higher or lower? And then there's the uncertainty of the election. I mean, I, I have my Trump hedge on. In the event Donald wins, I have no doubt in my mind the, the market tanks. And so I literally have put on a, a more than 100% hedge really? that I'll, kick, I'll, I'll put on stronger if it looks like there's a better what, what chance. What does that as mean? Donald forward. Trump wins in November. What is I, Mark Cuban I, doing? I, Mark Cuban, if, if the polls look like there's a, a, a decent chance that Donald could win, I'll put a huge hedge on that's over 100 percent of my equity positions and my, my bond position as well that protects me just in case he wins. What's so horrible about that prospect? I just think all the uncertainty. I mean, we don't know what Donald Trump's plans are. And just uh, right now, all we know are a little bit about his immigration, which tends to change on a day-to-day -day basis. And we know he's going to reduce taxes significantly. When you reduce taxes significantly, there's a timeline involved. Everybody's going to put off, you know, selling and doing anything until next year because of the drop in tax rates, if he's able to get it passed. And because of that, you're going to see a huge sell-off, I think, um, in, in stocks because people take advantage of any type of tax gain. And then who knows if the flip side comes through to, to prop it back up. I don't know. So many people were predicting a huge sell-off, huge, yes, huge, if Donald Trump was somehow able to beat Hillary Clinton and become the next president of the United States. Guess what? Trump won and the markets are ecstatic. <laughs>